What's up everybody welcome back to another video So today I'm heading out on a ride And we're going to an interesting place because We have been there before but at one point we've kind of backed out Because of uh, <laughs> certain things and I'll talk about that more up ahead but uh, right now I'm going to the meter point to meet with two of my friends I've ridden with them before in one of my videos um, It was that uh, Pechipare uh, Reservoir video It's 5.48 am in the morning It's kind of chill right now but don't worry Give it some time it's gonna fry us later But, <laughs> but I'm ready you know I'm ready it's been quite a while since I been on a outskirts ride like this a short outskirts ride hello wait on Look at this guy, crazy. Imagine the kind of sunset that you can witness in Kanyakumari. Oh, it's gonna be absolutely gorgeous. So it's time for an explanation to where I'm going I mean where we are going uh, I hope you guys have watched a video that I made two years ago that's uh, Kali Kesham waterfalls uh, it's in Kanyakumari district yeah so I had gone with Subit another Himalayan uh, he's a Himalayan rider and we had gone till the end of it that is if you guys watched that video in the end we came across this uh, um, a trail or a broken unpaved road which you know we didn't know what it led to we kind of spoke to one of the local over there and he said the route is fine we can take it it's not an issue but he said you might find elephants on that road and all that stuff you know and at that point of time we were really unsure if we want to take it because uh, we hadn't really planned for that because it's a it's a whole 1.5 ride through broken roads and Oh my lord look at this This is beautiful. It's very chill out in here <laughs> All right, so coming back to the story. Yeah um, So that road wasn't even registered on the map, but we use the satellite function to check if there's an actual you know trail or at least an unpaved uh, route throughout that place and it is it leads to Maniaguri if I'm pronouncing it right uh, I think it leads to Maniaguri that's the route that we're supposed to take right now which we eventually kind of figure out in the end oh my days what the what's this oh I love this place <laughs> Not gonna lie, but this route is pretty cool. I like it. Oh, these are rubber, yeah. Rubber trees. Aha. Yeah, I'm not gonna fall for the what? Why is this so beautiful? What? So nice. So chill. It's actually kind of cold out here. I'm wearing a mesh jacket as well, so I can feel it. Is it this cool? <laughs> I love, I love this formation of trees, you know. And the trucks have been constantly going through this uh, route. It's kind of, you know, carved the trees into that shape. It's nice. Yo, what the? <laughs> it's oddly cool for summer. Yeah, I know, right? Yeah. So one of the reasons that I want to do this trail is because I recently got Rice Trailer off-road tires Off-road in the sense, you know, 50-50 tires But I think these are more off-road centric But I really want to 
test these out and see how these goes people who follow me on instagram would know that i changed to these tires so um i keep you guys updated over there so please go follow i think it would be quite ideal to have breakfast and then go in because once you go through the check post i don't think you're gonna find anything so i'm gonna propose the idea of having breakfast <laughs> huh oh, mission accomplished <laughs> apparently everyone's hungry so Alright boys, let's go! Oh, okay, this works. Actually, the uh, check post will take. Oh, all right, <laughs> this is beautiful. Oh, this is gorgeous. This is uh, this reminds me of uh, Pechipare, to be honest. That reservoir that we went to. The time right now is around 7.40 or so but we have to wait till 9 o'clock in order to get in it's about 9 p.m. right now so we're about to leave these are the the rice trail are uh, that I was talking about and they have such a nice <laughs> you know pattern for off-roading and everything so I've got them in the front as well so let's see how these perform in those trails right now it's absolutely hot right now <laughs> it's nothing like in the morning This is where we came last time. I feel like the tires are really holding up man it's kind of nice I can feel the grip on these tires oh look at that rock up in there Where are you going? 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 Okay. Where are you going? Where are you going? Okay. 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 Okay.
சரி ஓகே crazy oh shit okay i hope they come slow <laughs> around the corners oh there's a water body over there I can't go full throttle on these uh, trails because what if there's an upcoming truck like before I'm going to head down collide with that thing Especially on Nora because uh she's quite heavy yeah because of the crash bars and you know the pannier rack and everything I need my bike to be a bit lighter for these kind of purposes So I'm planning to make a lighter but that would make me to sacrifice the uh, pannier stay and you know the luggage carrying capabilities of the bike in the future but i don't know i'm thinking Amazing, yeah. Adicha. Amazing view, man. Look at this. Let's ride a bit calm from now on, because I want to enjoy the views as well. That was nice. <laughs> so the rice trail our tires are amazing on road and off road surprisingly the grip that it offers uh, off road is amazing it's just splendid i had no traction loss whatsoever doing that trail over there the thing what i'm excited about is the fact that it's got so aggressive pattern you know almost close to a, a nobby tire and then they call it as a 50 50 tire which is on road and off road tire with such nobby patterns it's still good on road except for it being a bit loud that's all பொடியாயிட்டு 
on the way back to Marthandam. Uh, this road straight leads to Marthandam apparently. <laughs> Marthandam 16 kilometers. So that was a good timing, but yeah. <laughs> so 16 kilometers to Marthandam, and uh, yeah, I think we are back home after that. You know, just take the highway back home. In the beginning, the trail riding was kind of sketchy, but then as we spoke to the locals over there asking if we could take the route and if, is it safe to go ahead, we were kind of feeling okay to do that. And and then comes the confidence, and then comes the best, the riding bit. <laughs> and we're back on the highway, about to enter Kerala. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. You guys know the drill like the video, share the video, subscribe, and I'll catch you guys later. Bye bye.